I'm so sorry. Uh, social identity discrimination and inequality. Students who come to our camp build on the importance of integrating policy and science. They will focus critically on scientific fields, human rights, globalization, both economic, political, oh, and cultural, and examine the challenges of achieving best sustainable practices. We've been running our camp, this will be our 12th year this summer, and last year we had two children from 47 countries, although I believe no one from Taiwan came. Uh, there is a large contingent from the mainland. Uh, we hold it in Washington DC area on a college campus and bring around some of the, bring together some of the best and brightest young people from all over the world. It's a two week camp and our participants are exposed to other cultures from around the world, other societies, perspectives, and that really helps shape their views. They take workshops and lectures on such topics as global inequality, cultural diversity, international diplomatic exchange. They also participate in educational outings to Washington DC where they go to the White House. They usually see the Senate or the House of Representatives in session. They go to the monuments and they have in the past seen the Supreme Court in session, which is very exciting. Uh, they go to New York where they actually see, go into the real United Nations building, they learn about the UN, and they do a little sightseeing in New York. But really this camp is about building international connections between young people. And there are some kids from our camp. Um, it's a real, we run a three-day simulation that is a realistic simulation of the UN. Students do their research, and this is what Model UN is about. Students research and develop solutions to current issues. Um, last year, we had these six committees, which I've already talked about to you guys, so I don't see a need to say the same thing over again. What I didn't talk about was UN Women, and we do hold a UN Women Committee both at our camp in the United States and here at Shinmun. Uh, the camp has a STEM program, and you guys know all about STEM because you're at being educated in Taiwan, but it's a really wonderful opportunity for students to look at those sustainable goals and figure out some ways to achieve them. We work hard to empower youth, and we uh, hope that they will understand the meaning of global citizenship and look at key similarities and differences between global citizenship and national citizenship. Um, we basically talk about what